Hey everyone, enjoy the show. Oh, hey folks, how you doing today? Sorry about that, Joe. <laughs> so, two or three years ago, I purchased an antique roulette wheel, which actually came out of the El Cortez Hotel and Casino. It had Wells Fargo uh, Railway Express stamps all over it on its original shipping crate, which said to the El Cortez Hotel and Casino. So back in October of last year, I got a call from Alan Weisberg, who is the general manager of the El Cortez Hotel and Casino. And he said, hey Jim, I saw your video on our roulette wheel and uh, we have four of them in the basement and we're in would like to know if you're interested in buying them. I said, in a New York minute. So him and I got together, we cut a deal on the phone. Uh, he says, okay, you can't pick them up till we go through gaming. I said, no, no problem. He says, I'm gonna send you all the forms to go through gaming, which Jeff filled out. We sent them back and they said, you're good to go. You have no felonies. I don't know about Jeff, but I don't have any. So after that, I went up there, I made arrangements, I went up to the El Cortez. Of course, I told him, you gotta give me a free room, free meals, which he did. Super nice guy, he took me around, actually took me in the basement, because I insisted. He said, there's nothing left. I said, I gotta see for myself. Very nice man, thank you so much, Adam. And I might say that Adam, since he's taken that hotel over, every time I go to Vegas, I go to the El Cortez. I hadn't been there in a while. He did a very nice job, new carpet, the gaming is great there. They got $10 tables, friendly people, food is good, place is clean. I stayed in the new tower. It was a very nice stay and Adam was a great host. So I bought four roulette wheels from the El Cortez. One of them being here. I have in the past built a coffee table out of them for a fella up north, which is an officer up there. And it came out really nice. I've had a couple of more requests for uh, coffee table roulette tables, so I thought I would put a package together to offer to you folks. Once again, uh, it's, the nice thing about this setup is a, a professional roulette table with a 32 inch wheel in it is eight feet long and four feet wide. If you have a living room or something, it's gonna take up the whole thing. Gotta have a big house. I've got this package shrunk down to be very manageable and it's gonna be a great piece. So uh, once again, here is the paperwork, which I bought these, uh, the receipt, which I bought these, which this one is listed. You will get a copy uh, legitimizing this wheel came out of the El Cortez. The other thing I really didn't know at the time was the history of the El Cortez. I was quite fascinating. Uh, I'm going to show you a little piece of it, as well as we will include this in the still photos. Outside of the El Cortez, lit up in lights on the sidewalk, is the history of the El Cortez. So I'm going to go back and open in 1941. In 1945, uh, infamous mobster Bugsy Siegel and Meyer Lansky buy the El Cortez and use it as a training for the original employees who opened the Flamingo Hotel in 1946. So the mob actually bought into the El Cortez simply to train their employees for opening the Flamingo. Once again, you'll get a copy of this. Uh, we'll put a still picture of it. So here comes the receipt. So I, I bought what I thought would be a nice appropriate base for this as a coffee table. I sent out to my glass company, had a nice quarter inch piece of thick glass made for it cut a hole in the center. Uh, this wheel is absolutely killer, runs good, spins good, is good. As well as in here, I have included a ball, okay, so that you can play the game. This glass will simply just come right off and then you can go ahead and play roulette. Also, I'm including, which I thought was very cool, I picked up recently, was this oil cloth, probably from the 20s, fold up, let's see if I can get this off here. This folds up, it's got all its original markings. Super, super neat, very shrunk down, small size uh, roulette layout. Whoops, almost. Come on, baby, please. Now, this also came in its original carrying case, which is so cool. When you receive this, it will be folded up and come in its original uh, carrying case. As well as, you know, in order to make it complete, I wanted to add some nice vintage clay chips, unmarked, they're roulette, they'll work for this, put them on there, play. 
Because this set, it has three levelers here, which do not work on this base, but I include these. So if you do want to take it off the base and level it, there's uh, screw holes down there for the three levelers. This is a BC wheels table or roulette wheel. As you can see, it's in beautiful condition. Runs like a bat and a champ. This will be go next door as always to our craters and be professionally crated and shipped. They will bring it to your house, drop it off in the driveway or your garage. You will unbox it and take it inside. Super nice piece. Uh, I, I built a nice package. I personally would probably hang that on the wall behind this, put this out in front of my couch, put that on the wall. You're going to have a nice rig. It's a nice historical piece out of a historical hotel and casino in Las Vegas. And uh, make sure that you uh, push the bell, put us on watch, uh, watch all of our videos. We've got great response. We really appreciate it. I think we're up to about 1,700 videos on YouTube. We get calls all day, every day. This being one of them, uh, Adam called me up because he saw what we do and wanted us to, to represent them and sell them. Anyway, somebody's gonna get just a beautiful 32 inch legitimate casino full size roulette wheel coffee table and you will love it. It's unique. You'll be probably the only one that has it. Anyway, that's it folks. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. So uh, we really want to tell you we appreciate you watching our videos. We've done about 1,600 of them to date, and uh, you guys respond very nicely to it, and we really appreciate it. So if you like them, man, smash the subscribe button, right? Boom, hit the subscribe button and click on the reminder button, and if you do that, you will get reminded. There's a little bell there. Click on that. Uh, what we'd like you to do is make comments, and please make sure you share it with your friends. You guys are taking us to the top of the YouTube channel, and if you do those three things, you'll be able to see uh, us real time, especially if you hit the bell to remind you. It'll come up every time on your phone. We try to do a lot of fun stuff for y'all, and we appreciate you watching our videos. So let's smash it, let's grab it, let's watch them, let's comment, let's send us comments, share it with your friends. If you do that, you'll take us to the top, and we would really appreciate it. These are Mantiques. Antique, Mantique. These guys sell Mantiques. This is their store. We're picking, we're bringing stuff every day, in and out, in and out, in and out. We're, we're, we're shaking and baking. These are their customers. Give me the rundown on the GMC. This lived in a bar in Ghent in Belgium. Follow Jim and Jeff from nine to five or after hours as they buy, sell, and restore the coolest stuff for the coolest collectors worldwide.